Welcome to Punky's World. Um, one second. I the breath. Okay. I guess I'm going to grab this. Take my last dose. Yay. Um, we're going to celebrate one of our videos today. Sorry about the glare on my glasses. It's actually coming off the sun hitting the snow globe with my dad in it. Um, maybe I can it a little bit here. There, that's better. <coughs> Made a TikTok last night. I have to go over to Instagram um, to put up our giveaway. Again, I hope they let me mail it because it is now polished. But tomorrow, we've got an advent coming in. The Ultra Beauty one I wanted in the first place. So, <laughs> I'm excited about that. I also have my remote control coming in. And I ended up finding said remote control. Um, ah, I'm trying to get that glare off my glasses. There we go. Um, but that's okay because that remote control, like the lettering and stuff is, is gone in some areas, so I needed a new one anyway. Um, I just want to quickly show you to here what I did, okay? This is, no more spiral notebooks. They're all in here, in case I didn't show you that. That's not helping a whole lot. Um, and I put those notebooks there. Down here, I'm going to this out of the way. Over here, I put... my scrapbooking supplies. Over in that corner are my baskets with my lighting and a few other supplies. Up here, I rearranged after I took everything apart so that I could put it so that I could draw that for the reference now. Um, so I've got Kinesi, uh, yeah, genealogy here, some kidneys in here, which the other notebook goes right here, um, and historical society, all organized. <laughs> and then I have the presents that I was supposed to give candy and baby today. So, what you did? Whippy day. Oh no, what is it? It looks like a burpy trash can, actually. A, a, a trash um, truck. I could be wrong, but that's what it looks like. Doesn't it? And this one's a backhoe. This one's Whippy's backhoe. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so, I think um, all the guys will enjoy that. Along with his actual present. Um, but yeah, that's what I did. After I, um, whoa, there we go. After I went off last night, I finished that up. It was nice to be able to move the, um, scrapbooking supplies to a home, <laughs> you know.
and God's gifts and giveaways are here. The gifts are here, the other stuff is here. So, huh. I still have my opening right here to get out. So, but today, guys, um, I will put up the video about the <coughs> dumpster haul. And um, my friend did take a lot of the coats for her grandchildren, which is wonderful. Donated the rest. She absolutely loved the keys that actually make the car sounds for her grandson. And I actually had um, one of those glass salad dressing jars with the white lid, the white plastic lid. They used to come free with powdered salad dressing. And you just add, you know, oil and vinegar and bingo, you have a, a pretty salad dressing container. Um, it's been through the dishwasher and everything, but there was a bag set outside free. And it was one of the things in it. So, and I had put it through the dishwasher and everything. And the rest of the stuff was brand new. The containers had never been taken apart from each other, as you saw in the video. And um, she was looking for one of those for her brother-in-law and sister-in-law. And I said, I have one. So I gave it to her. I just been through the dishwasher. It's perfect. And it is. It's crystal clear. I don't think it was ever used, honestly. Um, so it like vines on. It's pretty, like etched into the into the glass. It's like bumpy. That's not the word. It's raised on the glass. Three dimensional. So, um, yeah, all of a sudden the sun disappeared. So. I am going to take my last dose. Yay! I am still testing positive, so. But I'm not really surprised. I still have a cough, and everybody knows. So, I don't know. Um, I'm going to give it a couple more days after the treatment is done, but I do know tomorrow I need to call and see if they want to move my shot because I'm COVID positive. They may want to, even though I've thoroughly been through the treatment. Um, you may want to change it. I'll keep you updated, um, and I'm okay with that. I might even send him a message over my chart. Not him, them. <laughs> um, I do want to... Oh, Bob brought me more food. <laughs> um, I am going to vacuum the kitchen and living room. It's going to be my housework for today. <laughs> I've been trying to do little bits. Oh, I took care of the closet, as I mentioned, so I could... I think I already shared that to you. So I could uh, put Christmas away. I'm not putting these lights away, because, like I said, I like the ambiance of them. I got a big order in my Amazon cart, but I'm buying myself a $50 gift card. So it won't actually be a big order, but I'm looking forward 
to it. There are three advent calendars in there. <coughs> None of them are over 40 bucks. Um, one's 30, one's 25, and one's 15.99. Plus I have a couple of other things including my new mics which have their own little charging port that I can sit out there and there's two of them so I can go back and forth just like I do with my batteries. And I can sit it right out there with my battery charger. So that's going to be ideal. So, um, I've watched the lady set it up on a video and stuff, so <laughs> it's perfect. Um, I'm very happy with that. The original um, advent calendar that I told you about that lights up was empty. It was under beauty advent calendars. I got rid of that and put a different one in. So I've got the W7, I've got a T1, and another beauty one coming. <coughs> Plus I have my remote control and the Alta one coming tomorrow. So we'll be doing the Alta advent calendar tomorrow. I'm very excited about that. Because that's the one I wanted. I didn't want the Alta Nails Advent Catalog. That was a boo-boo. But at least it was only an $11 boo-boo. And I, overall, with the number of nail enamels and, you know, nail art bases and stuff like that, top coat, I think I got my money's worth. <coughs> Even though it was a complete and utter mistake. <laughs> <laughs> if I had read it, I would have realized that. So. Oh. And I used the Vanilla Visa, and I do have another advent calendar coming from Walmart, January 16th. So we're going to have a total of seven in our playlist. We already have two in our playlist. I made our playlist. <laughs> so. I'm pretty excited. So six of them will be beauty and one will be tea. So I'm, like I said, very excited. And I have that container in that whole basket to put it all in because I'm going to do a roundup at the end of everything we got in each of the calendars. One of them I think is going to be skincare heavy, which is good because I don't have any skincare. So, and my cousin did find my moisturizing mask. So they're going to hold on to it for me till the next time I'm up there. So, that sucks. I mean, it, it, it sucks that I lost it, but it's good that they found it. <clears throat> it was on the floor in the closet in the uh, guest room. So I must have picked up my bag without it being closed, and it rolled out, and I didn't notice it. That's why I was searching everywhere for it and couldn't find it. Because it wasn't here. I figured it dropped out just about any place. So, I was going to order a new moisturizer. I don't know, I have to now. Because that Beauty Advent is, is um, skincare heavy. So, one of them. I can see bottles, but I, I can't see what's on them and I don't want to. You know what I mean? If that makes sense, I, I don't want to. <clears throat> I want to be surprised with each day. So I'm like blocking, literally blocking with my hands the products. <laughs> so, I'm glad there's at least one that's skincare heavy. I know a lot of people who open these on YouTube complain that they're so skincare heavy and they don't have as much makeup. I get it. But, as someone who needs skincare, I'm glad one of them is. So. <clears throat> and I believe the W7 has both. So, the other one is a big, the W7 is a 12 day. The other one that seems to be heavy on that stuff is um, a 24 day. So, the Alta is a 12. I think the other one that I got on Walmart is a 24. Um, but yeah. So, I did make, like I said, the playlist. And I put the Alta Nails boo boo. Um, and the other one, which, oh, the wild one, 
which was pretty good in my opinion. <coughs> For as cheap as it was over on Timu. <laughs> um, you know, you can also get that one on Amazon, but it's a little more. Uh, but I'm very happy. And I, uh, as you know, if you watched yesterday, I used the eyebrow product, and my um, wipes were able to take it right off. So that's good. You know, they say don't use makeup remover wipes. Well, I'm hoping to get some micellar water to try um, in the skincare I've done. We'll see. Because I've been wanting to try that for a long time. Because it's like a cleansing water, but with benefits for your skin. I'm hoping to get a toner. <clears throat> Although I'm planning to order one on Demo. Um, found a good one. Me finding a moisturizer is a pain in the neck because I have very sensitive skin. Um, matter of fact, I tried the um, green tea moisturizer from Proactive that I got um, at the flea market. It was just the, the little sample that they give you free when you buy the Proactive kit, you know? And I gotta tell you, that stung so bad. I figured it's green tea. It's going to be a gentle, natural moisturizer. Whatever else was in there did not agree with my skin at all. It went bye bye. So I'm like, okay, if my skin is that crazy sensitive, I got to be careful. So I went and read up on it, and I know what ingredients, you know, are okay for super sensitive skin, which I've always had. My mother's always had. Um, I know there's an LA moisturizer. That works great that my mother and I both used to use on our faces. Because my mother believed in taking care of your face differently than you take care of your body. If you're using dial on your body, for example, don't use that on your face. Do not use regular old bar soap on your face. Just don't. <laughs> it's not good for your face. First of all, it'll dry it out. But it's just not good for your face. Same thing with moisturizer. You don't want to use something you're going to moisturize your hands or, God forbid, your feet. Um, or even a whole body moisturizer on your face. You want something that's made for your face. And so my mother picked up the Olay. And it was great. I think the Olay did have the hyaluronic in it. And it, it, it gave us no problems. <laughs> I think I ended up finishing it up after she died. Um, because I really liked it. We would use little bits of it other places, but primarily it was for our faces. It was so soft. Um, I believe it was an anti-aging one, if I'm not mistaken, um, that we used. It wasn't cheap. It was a decent bottle, but it was like 20 bucks or something. But that's the one someone recommended to her. Alright, <laughs> oh, guys. Sorry, guys. Mm. Starting to get my energy back, so happy about that. I'll be glad that I'm not coughing this crap up anymore. Because there's no more to cough up, you know what I mean? I'm glad there's no more of this crap to cough up, but. <coughs> I don't know how we're going to celebrate, but we're going to celebrate 100 subscribers today. Uh, in the next video, of course. So, I want to get this vacuum done. And I'll be a very happy girl because I'm finally. Have my house clean. I need to clean my um, spacer from my uh, inhaler. Nice hot water last night. So I am going to take my pills and do this vacuuming. And I'll be a happy gal. I'll just have some clothes to put away probably tomorrow. Because they take a while to dry on the rack when you're drying them straight from the washer. They take three days or so to dry. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, which is fine. 
and I actually have the ones in the basket spread out. So, oh, one of the things in the basket is a pair of brand new Nike socks I found in the dumpster. So, I washed them up and look at myself a brand new pair of Nike socks that say just do it. I also have found a brand new pair of Jack Skellington socks. They even marked Disney, which I didn't notice, um, in the trash. So, <laughs> I got two pairs of socks. Um, those were a different day. Actually, they were both different days. But there were days when that's all I found, so I didn't make a video. Um, I think you're caught up on my dumpster finds now. Uh, those two pairs of socks. Is there anything else? I don't think so. I don't think so. Anyway. <coughs> God bless you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will see you for a celebration. I think we're going to bake something. Because my baking and cooking videos seem to be my my most popular videos on the channel. And what better way to celebrate? So I'll see you for that. I just want to get this done first. Bye, guys. God bless you. Thank you so much. We're going to start a new uh, goal. I'd like to have 200 subscribers. <coughs> Excuse me. By well, in honor of my Scots Irish heritage, I would like to have 200 subscribers by St. Patrick's Day. So let's do it. March 14th, I want to say. I have to look. <laughs> but yeah, that's the new goal. We can do it. We made this goal happen, and we can make that goal happen. <coughs> I'm going to talk to you about the history of the channel while we're making our celebration. Bye, guys. Mwah. God bless you.